Okay, this is you. A full-time academic weapon. Whenever you're in class or in lectures, you see other kids writing on their screens, annotating lecture slides, merging and splitting their PDF documents. Everywhere you look, there's just human beings popping out their iPads. But what if I told you that you don't need an iPad to be able to do all that? You can do all of this simply with a laptop and a first soft PDF. Hello, hey, hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome back to I'm Kwaketso and I am Kwaketso. As most of you know, I am a medical student at the University of Free State. And as a medical student, obviously, um, it comes with a lot of notes, a lot of studying and a whole lot of lecture slides. And I know personally that the best way for me to learn is if I annotate my lecture slides, I edit them, edit the PDF and write down my own notes on the slides themselves, which allows me to interact with them, which in turn helps me when it comes to understanding the content and remembering all the concepts. And I am excited to share with you a software or a tool that actually revolutionized the way I interact with PDF documents. Ladies and gentlemen, learners of all ages, introducing a first soft PDF. Now, if you're wondering what a first soft PDF is, it is an easy to use software that allows learners and professionals alike to edit PDF documents, annotate them, split and merge, and really interact with documents. This software allows me to view documents, edit them, and it also has a function called OCR recognition where you can scan a document that is uneditable and it allows you to actually edit the document. It also has a feature that I actually like using. It is sort of like, it's an AI feature where you can actually ask it questions about the content itself. So you upload your lecture slides, for example, and then you start asking questions about the lecture slides. You can even ask it for summaries and it does all of that for you. And today I'm going to try a first off PDF with you and I'll be doing that on my laptop to show you how exactly I use it to make sure that it works for me and in my day-to-day -day life. But before we get too far, I must mention that a first soft PDF is actually available on many platforms, including Windows, Mac OS, iOS, web, and as a fast developing platform that it is, it is set to support Android, Linux, and iOS in the future. And the best part about it is that one account, which perhaps you created on your Windows, the account actually spans over and stretches across all terminals. When you create an account on your web, on your laptop, on your Windows, you can actually use that account on your phone. You can use that on your web, you can use it on your desktop, your Mac OS, your MacBook, and everything as such. Now on desktop, a first soft PDF actually has quite a number of features. It has multiple features which you can use and exploit to your advantage. The first being the reading and printing. It actually allows you to read and print things in, 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 in high quality. It allows you to print your content and your lecture slides in seriously high quality. So now what I'm going to do now is I want to start firstly and showcase the text editing part of it. And what I do is I take a document, I go to my files, start from looking for the document. And as soon as I found my document, I want to now go into the lecture slides and then take these lecture slides and I want to start editing. Now, the first thing that I want to do in my editing is perhaps start by highlighting here to show you that you can actually annotate and work with this uh, uh, PDF. Now, notice how using other applications, you cannot edit a PDF. You can only edit a Word document. Now, with the first soft PDF, it allows you to edit a PDF, which is actually one of its functions, which makes it key and puts it above from the rest. Another thing that you can do with the first soft PDF, which is actually grand, is it allows you to rearrange, delete, rotate, and extract pages. Now, this is something that cannot be done on many softwares that you might know of. The ability to take page six of your lecture slides and rearrange it and put it on page nine and put page nine for page six. So now what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to take one of these pages. This ability for it to process the pages and actually do it like this is incredibly game changing. Because what I can do again is I can simply delete this picture if I don't want it. I can rotate and I can extract many pages. This is limitless and absolutely magnificent, to be honest, to say the very least. It's, 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 it's an incredible game changer. It has helped me a lot when it comes to engaging with my content. Now, the next function of a first soft PDF that I want to explore is the conversion. What I can do is I can actually create formats 
as PDF and I can also convert PDF documents into other formats, the likes of Word documents, the likes of Excel and the likes PPTX and all of that. So I'm going to take this PDF document and done. There it is. I have now made it a Word document which I can edit because we know that that is the basic principle that a first soft PDF allows you to do, which is editing PDF documents, which are more often than usually not as easily annotatable or edited. Now on my laptop where I'm actually unable to write, I use this one where I annotate, whether I highlight, write a side note, or just simply underline certain words. And when it comes to the highlighting, you can actually use the preset colors or you can create your own custom colors, which makes it very limitless because you don't only get a limitation to red, blue, white, or whatever the colors are. And this annotation is actually so incredible because personally, it helps me do all of these things. I can put a sticker on something to show its urgency. I can highlight something red to show that it is important and I can move things, move a text, shift it, and edit all these texts that are on my notes. The next feature of a first soft PDF which actually came to me as a shock because this is something that most of us have tried sometime or another. Were you able to convert scanned documents to editable documents? And how you do this is you actually take a picture of a scan, which I'm going to use this uh, document here, hoping that copyright is not reserved. And what I'm going to do is take the scan and it will actually use OCR recognition to allow me to edit this text and allow me to play around with the words that are on here. And all of this can be done simply using one app. Just like that for me. You know, it's how this software is actually something that is incredible. I, I, I was shocked when I saw the software for the first time because um, I checked it out and I was impressed. I'm not going to lie. I'm being very genuine. I was incredibly impressed. The fact that you're able to send it your lecture slides and be able to interact, ask it questions, have a conversation with it, tell it that. Um, I'm finding this difficult. How do I best understand it? It is able to use its AI tool that exists within it to allow you to actually find these summaries, find this explanation, and actually interact with it in a way that will benefit you. The way that it does that is it allows you, it, it gives you summaries, Q&A conversation, and also the translation of PDF documents where maybe there is something that does not make sense or it's written in some foreign languages. And this is something that is incredible and quite different when you actually compare it with applications that are at its level, to be honest with you. On web, you can actually preview PDF files online. You can share files with multiple users for simultaneous viewing. And you can also set permission for shared files and folders, recent files and start files. Now what that means is, a first off PDF is a place where you can actually store your files, play around with them, keep them there, edit them, come back for a PDF. So basically what we are doing here is we are playing around with our PDFs. This is a first soft PDF tool that allows you to edit and play around with your PDFs, interact with them and make sure that everything is as seamless as it's supposed to be, ensuring an incredible learning experience. Now, I have made mention quite a number of times of how a first soft PDF is actually better than many software apps or programs that are actually out there. And that is because of basically everything that I've mentioned so far. And also because it is a multi-terminal integration, which as I've said, where you can uh, make an account on your web or you can make an account on your desktop on your Windows laptop and it will cut across and stretch across all your devices and you'll be able to use the same account. It also has strong performance, fast startup speed and fast opening speed. So you don't have to take too many hours waiting for something to load. It also has AI intelligence that we've spoken about, the ability for it to summarize content for you, Q&A, conversate with you and actually translate content for you. And the text editing is what I came here for. The fact that it allows you to edit a PDF almost as if it is a PPT text. And also the ability to convert OCR. That is taking a picture of a scanned document and editing it basically as if it is, I don't know, your own piece of writing or something like that. It is multi-format, multi-language, and it is an industry leader. Now, if everything that I've said sounds incredible and awesome to you as it does to me, you can try a first soft PDF today for free or if you want to get a membership or an account that will actually last you, you can get an account that is for a year, an account that is for three years, an account that is actually monthly, and you will get 30% off a loyal plan that is absolutely premium, high quality. Try it today and get a link in the description box 
down below. And also, if you're struggling to use a first soft PDF or you're finding quite a number of things difficult or something just does not make sense to you, a first soft PDF has a customer service that will actually reply to you and assist you, making sure that they promptly resolve all your customer services, complaints, concerns, and questions to ensure a seamless experience when it comes to learning. Try a first soft PDF for free today by clicking on the link in the description box down below or if you want a 30% discount on the high performance, high quality premium membership, you can click on the link as well that will be in the description, which allows you to get an, an account that works across all platforms, as I've said, across all terminals, Mac OS, it works on your MacBook, Windows, etc. Nice. Thank you to a first soft PDF for sponsoring this video. This was so exciting for me to share this tool because it has personally helped me. It's something that makes my learning experience a bit better when it comes to interacting with lectures. But yeah, otherwise, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and peace!